Rebecca Vardy just can't seem to stay out of the spotlight, for all the wrong reasons. Despite the legal and financial turmoil following her disastrous libel case against Colleen Rooney, she's back at it again, embroiled in yet another WAG feud. But this time, the stakes are even higher, as her husband Jamie Vardy faces his own financial setbacks, making the drama more than just a tabloid headline. So, why does Rebecca keep digging herself deeper into trouble? The saga of Rebecca Vardy, often referred to as the Wagatha Christie scandal, has been a train wreck in slow motion, one that keeps gaining momentum despite all signs urging her to stop. It began with Vardy's infamous lawsuit against Colleen Rooney, which not only cost her a whopping three million pounds but also left her reputation in tatters. One would think that such a public humiliation would prompt a quieter, more cautious Rebecca. But just this past week, fresh drama involving leaked messages between Rebecca and Annie Kilmer, wife of footballer Kyle Walker, found its way to the press, showing that Vardy is still in the thick of celebrity mess. With legal battles, financial woes, and ongoing feuds, the Vardy household seems to be under constant pressure, and it's Jamie Vardy who is bearing the brunt of it all. The newest chapter in Rebecca Vardy's never-ending drama started with a series of private messages. Annie Kilmer, reeling from the news of her husband Kyle Walker's affair with Lauren Goodman, confided in Rebecca, expressing her frustration and anger in what she thought was a private conversation. Annie's words were harsh, at one point even saying she wanted her husband's former mistress dead. What was meant to be a venting session between friends somehow made its way to Lauren, and soon after, these heated messages were splashed across the front pages of The Sun. This revelation, coupled with Lauren hiring Rebecca's publicist, has led to speculation about how the private messages became public in the first place. For many, this incident is a baffling misstep for Rebecca, especially after the costly fallout from the libel case against Colleen Rooney. Rebecca's persistent involvement in WAG feuds, despite her previous legal battles, paints a picture of someone addicted to drama, unable to resist the lure of scandal even at the cost of her own stability. After losing millions in the Wagatha Christie trial, she is now facing another legal setback, as she was recently ordered to pay Colleen Rooney a further £100,000 towards the hefty legal fees. With the five-year anniversary of the Wagatha Christie post recently passing, one would assume Rebecca had learned to steer clear of controversy. Yet, here she is, back in the headlines for all the wrong reasons, once again at the center of another WAG-related storm. The strain of this drama extends beyond Rebecca, impacting her husband Jamie Vardy, who has his own set of troubles. In a bid to secure his future after football, Jamie made a significant investment in a U.S. soccer team, the Rochester Rhinos. However, the club went bust last year, citing an unsustainable business model. This setback, combined with Rebecca's legal costs, has put immense financial pressure on the family. With Jamie still playing for Leicester City at the age of 37, there's no denying that his career is winding down and any future contracts may not be as lucrative. Sources close to the couple suggest that Jamie is the sole breadwinner right now, carrying the weight of the family's finances on his shoulders. Despite these challenges, Rebecca continues to flaunt her lavish lifestyle on social media, leaving many to wonder if she has any awareness of the reality that's closing in around her. For Jamie, it must feel like the drama is never-ending. Sources suggest that he often retreats to his man cave at their £3 million Lincolnshire home, a sanctuary away from the chaos. But the pressures of supporting his family and dealing with Rebecca's ongoing legal battles must be taking a toll. The strain is evident, and there are rumors that Jamie may need to consider moving clubs, potentially to a less desirable but more financially rewarding league, just to maintain their lifestyle and cover their mounting debts. For a man who has built his career on hard work and focus, this entanglement in drama must be a bitter pill to swallow. Rebecca Vardy's ongoing saga is a cautionary tale of unchecked ambition, poor judgment, and an insatiable appetite for drama. Despite her many defeats, she seems determined to keep fighting battles she's already lost, dragging herself and her family deeper into a pit of financial and reputational ruin. For Jamie Vardy, who continues to shoulder the financial burden, it's a situation that can only be described as draining.
As Rebecca faces more court rulings, mounting debts, and fresh controversies, the question remains, will she ever learn when to walk away, or is she destined to be trapped in a cycle of self-created chaos? Only time will tell, but if the past is any indication, the drama is far from over.